Welcome to the SAP Business One HANA series on creating KPIs. Our company, OEC Computers, are experiencing issues with the Rainbow Printer sales item. The service manager has requested a KPI on a number of open service calls for this printer. He has requested a threshold of a maximum of five service calls relating to this item. In order to create our KPI, we navigate to the Pervasive Analytics Designer. From here, we are able to select New KPI. And now we need to select the base data source for our KPI. And in this case, it's a user-defined query that we created. Once we've opened the query that we've created, we now need to select in the Value Settings tab the Count field as the KPI value. We now need to choose the appropriate unit. And in this case, there isn't any. So we select the unit as None. This value represents a count number and doesn't require a unit. We now need to navigate to the Filter and Parameters tab. From here, we need to drag the Create Date field into our Parameters box. And then we need to select the year 2018. We then drag the item code into our filter box and we select the actual item that we're interested in monitoring, which is the rainbow printer. We then now simply select the status field and here we would like to select open as we would like the KPI to represent all open service calls only. And now we need to set the threshold for our KPI. So back in the value settings tab, we can add a threshold value. In the KPI goal description, we enter open service calls. We can now underneath set a goal value. If I set a goal value of 5, a goal value that is a lower value than the set goal value preferred will be shown in green. The blue number indicates that there are exactly 5 open service calls relating to the rainbow printer. We're now going to select the checkbox smaller value is better. If I then change this number from 5 to 4, we can see that there are more open service calls than the threshold set value of four, and therefore the number will be shown in red. If I change the goal value threshold to seven, our KPI will then be displayed in green, which indicates that there are less than seven open service calls for that particular item. I'm going to set the KPI threshold to five. Finally, we need to save this KPI by entering a KPI name and description, for example, Rainbow Printers. And then we select Save As. Once we have created our KPI, we can add this KPI to our cockpit. We simply select the Add icon and navigate to our newly created KPI. Here we can now see our Rainbow Printer Service Call KPI that we just created, and we can simply check the box in order to add it to our cockpit. And then we simply update our cockpit. If, for example, an additional service call is created for that item, so if we navigate to service, service call, and we select rainbow printer, upon adding that service call to the system, the next time our cockpit is refreshed, we can see that our KPI indicator has changed from five to six, and it's also changed color. It is now in red because the open service calls for our rainbow printer exceeds the threshold value of five. The service manager can now easily monitor service calls for the rainbow printer using this KPI in his cockpit, and the change in color will help him to identify critical situations that can be acted upon proactively.